I'm from a suburb of Cleveland, Ohio. It's a very like, under-resourced community and college wasn't the highest priority among students nor uh, teachers. When I was in high school, I planned on being an aerospace engineer. My school didn't even offer like SAT testing in the building. I had to go to a different school district to take the SAT. So preparation for SAT classes really was kind of non-existent. A lot of students in my high school were somewhat apathetic toward the rigorous science and math-based subjects and they didn't feel like they were really related to their everyday lives. The questions on the Almost Fun app are way less boring than the questions like students typically encounter. Never have I found myself laughing while taking some tests. It would have allowed them to engage more with what they were learning, and when you're engaging more with what you were learning, you retain more of that information. I tell students in my high school to download the Almost Fun app because I think it would motivate them to perform better on the SAT. Hi, my name is Lisa Wong and I'm the founder of Almost Fun. We are reinventing test preparation for the students who need it the most. My parents worked really hard to give me educational opportunities that they never had. And I don't know if you can tell from this photo, but they were really excited when I got into Harvard. That is actually a Harvard backpack that my dad is wearing as well. They were so excited because they saw that I was able to do something that they never had the chance to do. Growing up in rural China, my dad figured out that he was good at math because he knew when his textbooks were wrong, even when his teachers didn't. He's brilliant, but he never had the resources I had. When I started working at Google as a product manager on the education team, we were building for all students, but I really wanted to focus on students like my dad I started teaching SAT prep at underserved schools, and I found that my students were just as brilliant, with a similar lack of resources. Alia was a student that I taught last summer. She knew that in order to get into her dream college, she had to do well on her standardized tests. But the content that we give students like Alia is not created for them. Take a look at this problem. See if you can read through it and muster any motivation to learn. No, you can't, it sucks, and it's extremely intimidating for students. Test prep looks like this because it's optimized for students with resources. Drilling practice problems over and over again works if you already know the basics and you're just trying to get those last 200 points, but not if you're struggling at the lower end of the score spectrum. And test prep companies know this. When they make a guarantee of a high score, they require you to come in with a high score already. And what's worse is that they charge thousands of dollars for this content. My students were playing a rigged game. We are building test prep for the students who need it the most. We deliver quick and inspiring content accessibly through a mobile app that is always free. We use relatable situations and culturally relevant pop culture from movies and music and TV shows that students are already excited about. And we feature young, diverse professionals who are using SAT skills in their jobs today so students can see how a photographer is using proper grammar and punctuation to communicate with her clients and build her brand. Studies have shown that using culturally relevant education and positive role models improves learning outcomes and increases test scores. By meeting students where they are, we help them ramp up to the standardized tests that they have to take. I started Almost Fun for my students, but I left my job to work on this full time because I believe that all students deserve to have the resources they need to go to college. There are 12 million underserved students in the US who should be preparing for these tests each year. Our goal is to help 1 million of these students prepare by the end of 2021. We're raising $500,000 to expand our platform beyond iOS grow our content library, and partner with college prep organizations. If you believe that all students deserve to have the resources they need to go to college, please support us. With your help, students like Alia can go to the colleges of their dreams. Thank you.